I do not say this because I have lacked anything. I have learned to manage with whatever I have. I know how to live modestly and I know how to live luxuriously too. In every way now, I have mastered the secrets of all conditions. Full of stomach and empty stomach, plenty and poverty. There is nothing I cannot do in the one who strengthens me. In this scripture, we are misled to think that when St. Paul said I can do all things, he said that you can win jackpot, you can win lottery and fly on the grill without going to a pilot school because he said you can do all things. That's not what he meant. The message for us is to encourage us to know that in all circumstances, whether good, whether bad, we as children of God, as Christians, can do all things. Even in empty stomach, even in luxury, even in the poverty, because our conditions as children of God are every day influenced by the situations and the circumstances around us. You know, a lot of things happen, some of which we don't bargain for those things. The fact that you are smiling is not because there is no problem. It's not because all is well. It's not as if there is no challenge in your life. But you are smiling because you have a God who is bigger. This God that we serve, this Jesus Christ in the blessed sacrament that we adore every day, is bigger than any problem, bigger than any situation. Even though you go through the valley of the shadow of death, you fear no evil. So you don't have to be afraid because we serve a God that through Him we can survive every circumstance, every situation, every condition of our life. Every given trouble that comes our way, some we don't bargain for. But we have a God who is there, who can help us. That is why He tells us that He cannot give us a problem that is bigger than us. I want to let you understand that there is nothing that is going to break your radar. That difficult situation is going to make you. I want you to let you turn your stumbling block to stepping stones. It is when you drive Joseph to Egypt that Joseph was able to realize and to be able to actualize what God has destined for him to be that great dreamer and save the people of Egypt and of course his own people by extension. He said if he was not sold by his brothers, there is no way he would have been able to realize and actualize his dreams in life. Sometimes our situations are spreading and helping out the best in us. Just like the when we say that song, God will make a way where they seem to be no way. Let the poor say, I am rich. Let the weak say, I am strong. But I want you to look up to Jesus today. He is the Lamb of God who will take away the sins of the world. He is the one that can help you in that difficult situation of yours, in that trouble of yours. I remember when I was about to impact on so many projects in my parish, some persons told me, Father, we don't have enough resources, you can't do it. These things are too difficult. I told him, I said, our help comes from the Lord. With God, all things are possible. The circumstances may become very tough. And you think that there is no God, but there is God because he said we can do all things through him who strengthens us. He gives us that encouragement that even the world itself cannot give us. He becomes a second force that propels us into doing things that ordinarily we will not be able to do. I pray for you today, as you listen to me, I pray for you today, in every trial of yours, in every struggle, in every difficulty, in everything you are fighting for, God will fight with you. God will support you. God will encourage you. God will be with you. He will never walk alone. He will walk with you and success shall accompany you. Progress shall accompany you. Whatever you touch your hand has turned out successful to the glory of his name through Christ our Lord. May the Almighty God bless and strengthen you, the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. As I advise you to share this video. And don't forget to subscribe so you can get more videos from this channel. Thank you very much.